Okay, now uh, this is with the pretty terrific uh, Mix Pre 3. And uh, so we're recording off of that into the uh, Nikon 6. And um, to my knowledge, we're still recording 10 bit. I'll double check that before uh, I take that in, take this in to be, uh, you know, checked. But I think our sound, if we're not clipping, which, you know, is always an impossibility, uh, and we shouldn't do that, um, that's bad, bad. Uh, I've got the camera internal uh, turned on the camera to minus one, okay, manual minus one, so it's turned down as far as possible. Uh, without completely cutting sound off. And then um, the uh, Mix Pre 3 is taking care of all the rest. So uh, we should be able to get some uh, pretty good pretty good audio here, um, you know, and we don't have to worry about that uh, external recorder there um, unless, you know, we take it into the field uh, because it's easy to forget turning off those batteries, and uh, when you forget, then those batteries are gone, 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 and you don't want that. But everything here now, except for the camera, is being electrically powered, and so we shouldn't even shouldn't worry about, except uh, replacing the the batteries uh, on occasion. But again, we're not recording internally; we're recording externally, and I uh, see a little latency there. And we're occurring externally with the Atomos Ninja Flame. And um, I'm kind of excited to see, or see and hear the results.